Writing is one of those things that's like, when it's good, it's amazing. I can see things that you want right through and I listen to the lessons lost on you in your race to escape the truth. I started studying piano when I was five. I started classical as the most, I mean, it's not even classical at that point. It's like, you know, good King Wenceslas and that kind of thing. Um, but you know, you work up to the real easy classical pieces and, and then you start getting into harder stuff like uh, Beethoven and Bach and um, eventually Chopin. I hated taking lessons, like I hated reading and thinking and working like that. You know, learning to play piano is tedious. Amber turned cold and turned out the noise inside. She found her own Nobody in my family is musically talented at all. I'm kind of like the anomaly. When I was young, young, my parents would buy me stuff. You know, they'd buy me like Duran Duran and Aha and um, Pat Benatar and Journey and Foreigner. And my dad and I kind of had a lot of the same tastes in music. He's like, he was like this old dude, but he loved going to concerts. He used to take me to concerts all the time. My first concert was Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers, I was five years old. By the time I was old enough to buy my own albums, I was into a lot of hard rock. So I was buying like Metallica, Megadeth, Slayer. Um, I went through a very tumultuous period of my life when I was a teenager and I sort of sought solace in that music. I love Jonathan Brooke and nobody knows who she is and it kills me. It's just some of the most talented singers, writers, artists, like nobody knows who they are. It's just wrong. I shine like the Alabama moon He's looking for a promised land I'll be on the lights of Certain types of jazz, like certain styles, there's a sort of sub-branch of jazz called fusion, um, and that I really liked. There's a band called the Yellow Jackets, um, certain guitar players like Mike Stern, Pat Metheny, Alan Holdsworth, Oh God, just amazing stuff. And so I used to transcribe their solos, which is where you listen to it, and then you figure out what they're playing, and then you actually write it out. And that exercise is like one of the most amazing things you can do as a musician for your ears and for your chops too, because then you go play their solos and it's not easy. Around that time I started studying with a session musician that um, toured a lot with like Billy Joel. He played on, um, White Snake's album. He was one of like my early mentors, and um, so he basically prepared me for um, to go to Berklee College of Music, which is where I went to school. decision to pursue music as a career was never like, I'm going to do this. It's like, I didn't choose it, it chose me. That's how I feel. It's, it, I, it's, it's almost like I have no choice in the matter. It just pulls me. If you want to know more about me, you can visit my website, arunamusic.com, or you can find me on MySpace, myspace.com slash aruna. In the meantime, stick around to find out more about me and my music.